In our search for information about the suspected gunman, we're getting a picture today of a very unstable man, and here's what we know so far. Ivan Lopez served four months in Iraq in 2011. Fort Hood's commanding general told reporters he had known mental health issues. He was currently under diagnosis for post-traumatic stress disorder, but had not been officially diagnosed with PTSD. Yeah, Lopez was undergoing behavioral health care for depression and anxiety, and he had some sort of self-reported traumatic brain injury, but was not physically injured in combat. So Kate Whitehall is here, and she's been digging uh, all morning long into more information and how this all played out maybe yesterday. Yeah, you know, it's even though he has not been officially diagnosed with right. PTSD, it's really kind of important to go over exactly what that is, what it means, and often how it's treated. Because we often hear about soldiers suffering from PTSD after coming home from war. They are offering suffering from nightmares, flashbacks, and just overall feeling of being numb. Now, if you watch someone dealing with this, you might think they're suffering from depression, substance abuse, or have some other physical or mental health problem. So, how is it treated? Oftentimes, talking to a therapist. Sessions revolve around helping the person understand what they're going through and try to rethink how to deal with trauma and its aftermath. Therapists also help someone cope with feelings like anger, guilt, and fear. Antidepressant medication can also be prescribed to help. And one of the reasons Lopez may have not been officially diagnosed is because, according to the U.S. Department of Veteran Affairs, it's very common to have PTSD at the same time as another mental health problem, like depression, alcohol or drug abuse problems, panic disorder, and anxiety disorders. So while you're being treated for one of those issues, the therapist may also determine the person is suffering from PTSD at the same time. Brian. Counseling is also available for the families there on post and relatives of